Welcome Hatchet members, this is your Monday workout. So our warm up is gonna be a five minute block and the first two minutes of that block is just gonna be pure cardio. So you can choose to do anything you like. If you happen to have a rower, that's great. If not, you can just do running in place, you can do burpees, you can do skipping. Anything that just gets your heart rate elevated is what we're looking for here. And then the remainder of that five minutes, which will be three minutes, it's just gonna be done as an AMRAP with some dumbbell and body weight movements. So the first one is gonna be suitcase dumbbell lunges. So Kelly's gonna grab the dumbbell, she's in the suitcase position. She's gonna take a step forward, drop the knee to the floor, drive back up, alternate legs. That'll be five on each leg, 10 total. She's then gonna go into 10 dumbbell curls to press. So she's gonna curl the belts up and then press them up overhead, back down, curl, and press. That'll be 10 reps there. She'll put the bells on the floor, and now we're gonna go into up down. And up down is a burpee without touching your chest to the floor. So she's gonna lower down, pop back up, and go jump there. So that'll be 10 reps like so. So just rotate through that for the remainder of that five minutes. Then we're gonna jump into a full body strength here. So for this, you're just gonna need a pair of dumbbells. This is gonna be done every two minutes for five sets. So it's only gonna take you 10 minutes to get through. If you have a heavier pair of dumbbells, you can use them for the deadlifts and then switch to a lighter pair for the overhead work if you like. If you don't have that opportunity to, to change bells, just go slower and work on time under tension. So the first one is gonna be five staggered deadlifts on one leg. She's gonna take a small step forward. The front leg will have a soft bend in it. She's gonna shoot the hips backwards as she descends her chest forward, keeping the tension on the hamstrings and the glutes like so. So it's just accentuating more hamstring tension. She's then gonna do five reps there and switch and does five reps on the other leg. Now, if you have a lighter pair of dumbbells, great, you can switch them now. She's gonna pop the bells up on the torso, or sorry, the front rack. She's gonna go into eight dumbbell push press. Dip, drive, and press up overhead. Remember to use the hips for quarter extremity power. She's then gonna keep the bells in the front squat rack position, and then we're gonna go into six very slow and controlled front squats. Again, if you have lighter bells here, spend more time in the descent because you're gonna have more time and attention, like so. So this will be done every two minutes for five sets and it should be a pretty solid burner. Then we're gonna move into a full body workout now. And for this, all you need is a pair of dumbbells. If you have a rower, that's great. If you don't have one, don't worry about it. You're just gonna use the same uh, cardio movement that you used in the warm up. So this is gonna be six sets of one minute of cardio just there to get your heart rate up. Don't crush it, don't murder yourself because the real, real meat and potatoes in this workout is these dumbbells. So one minute of straight cardio, and then you're gonna go into one minute, 30 seconds of as many devil press as you possibly can. Let's go over the devil press right now. So devil press is like a burpee with dumbbells. She's gonna have the, dumb, uh, the dumbbells on the floor at shoulder width. She's gonna lower her hands onto the bells, touch her chest to the floor, pop herself up, swing the bells in between her legs, and then pull them up overhead. Now let's go through one more. Chest touches the floor, swings them up overhead. Now the overhead position is elbows are locked out. They're stacked over top of her shoulders, her hips, her uh, knees, and her ankles, and swing back down. So you're gonna rest 30 seconds in between every set, and then you're gonna record the total amount of devil press that you completed over the course of six sets in the comments below. Then our finisher is gonna be a pretty uh, solid arm blaster. It's gonna be five sets of 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off of just alternating dumbbell curls, like so. So if you have a lighter pair here, you can spend more time under tension, slowing things down. If you have a heavier pair, really try to avoid swinging at all costs. So that'll be five sets of 40 on and 20 off. Okay guys, so that's your Monday workout. Comment below your scores and we'll see you tomorrow. Cheers.